I have been so excited to do one of these videos for a really long time and now that I'm kind of like transitioning between styles I thought what better time to do it than now. Um, I, I don't even know my sense of style anymore, it's just totally shifted in um, I guess the six months that I've been in lockdown I'm just having yet another identity crisis <laughs> but in my short stint here on YouTube I have made a very good friend, her name is Steph, I will leave her link down below because her YouTube channel is aesthetic dreams she is such a queen and she has really helped me in finding my new style and identity and i don't even think she realizes that she's done that but i've literally watched every single one of her videos and they bring me so much joy because she's such a sweetheart and her aesthetic her style is just everything i just she's so sweet i love her so much and i thought who better to do my first style bundle than Steph because I feel like she really gets the style that I'm going for and she inadvertently inspired this look which was supposed to be my Virgo look but we're channeling Steph today, we're really vibing. I know she's probably watching this. Hey Steph, I love you girl. I've, I've had this box for maybe two, three days now and I've been waiting for the chance to film so I can give you my full review and excitement and everything. So the reason why I chose Steph was obviously because she's an opposite queen and I feel like she really understands the, the style I go for and I really like her kind of style. So I've been saying to her for a really long time, look girl, I really want you to do my first bundle, but I don't really know what my style inspirations are right now because I'm kind of like going between the 90s grunge to like, I guess 70s androgynous rock and roll bohemia. I think that's kind of what I'm going for. So I just sent her a Pinterest board and I was like, this is kind of what I'm looking at. And she got really excited. And I have no doubt in my mind that she is gonna nail it. So without further ado, without any more explanation, because I know that you just want me to open the box. I want to open the box. <sighs> my heart is pounding. I'm just so excited. Yeah, let's just bloody get into it. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I see velvet, I see velvet, I see velvet, oh my god. Right, I, I want to read the, the letter first, but I also feel like that might spoil the excitement of the items. So, since the items are already open right now, I'm just going to go through them and then I'm going to see how she pieces it together because I am. Oh. oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Um. So I did send her, her my measurements and and she was like, yeah, cool. And I just let her do what she wanted to do. <gasps> I don't I don't know how to react. I, I, I always watch these videos and I'm like, how can people be so like chill about it? This is really exciting. So I'm just I'm just gonna roll with it. So sorry if I'm really annoying, but it is what it is. <gasps> oh! <gasps> Oh my god, oh my god, I have been literally saying to everyone and the cows and the sheep and the I don't know the turkeys in the field that I only want to flares from this point forward because I am five foot two and nothing makes my figure look better than a pair of flares. I I have been looking for a patterned pair of flares that aren't too garish and that I can kind of pull off. And I think these are it. And they have an elasticated waist for my fat ass. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm so excited. <gasps> and it has a pocket! <gasps> ah! <laughs> Sorry. Ah! <laughs> Just chaotic energy. Oh my god. <gasps> oh wow. <gasps> Aren't these just amazing? Oh my god. Are these like mandalas? Oh my god. I hope these fit. They should fit. Uh, oh my god these are so cool they're like a chiffon material which is awesome because all of my flares at the moment are either denim or velvet and it can be too hot and sweaty so now that it's summer because i don't have any summer pants these are gonna be perfect although i guess it's august now so is summer over no it's september oh my god what time is it <laughs> Oh, these are so cool. Right, anyways, let's move on, let's move on. Let's move. Right, I'm gonna try them all on the end and we'll see what it looks like, but I have no doubt it's gonna look chef's kiss. <gasps> oh, 
sorry. These are just so cool. Ah! <gasps> Ooh! Oh, this is cute. This is cute. This is cute. Oh my god. I love velvet. I, I don't even know if I told her that I liked velvet. I maybe did. I probably did. I love I feel like this might be accessories. So I'm gonna keep this to the end. Oh my god, I'm so okay. I'm so sorry. <laughs> is this? Is this? <gasps> no way! <gasps> I don't know if I told her that I really wanted a waistcoat. I don't own a waistcoat and I've been looking all over Depop for a waistcoat and I uh and it's velvet it's velvet oh my god oh my god this is perfect <gasps> look at those little buttons oh my god this is exactly what i was looking for oh my god you know what it kind of reminds me of like a little bit of like a mi military style um with the the shape of the buttons oh my god major vibes oh my god and it's by ralph lauren i mean i'm not a designer ho but like girl you really suss me out um i'm pretty sure actually she sent me a video to a runway um from 2015 i can't remember it was maybe it was ralph no it wasn't ralph lauren I will leave that link below the video that she sent me and she was like what do you think of this and I was like <gasps> yes that is me to a T that is where I want to be that is my style inspo and I feel like waistcoats came up a lot in my Pinterest board so this is yes you got me girl oh I can't wait I'm so excited Ooh. You know what? I was actually looking for a little brown bag. This is so cute. I love the detailing this is so cute and the leather strap ah oh, yes bath and body works i think that's maybe an american brand i've never heard of it in the uk it has a cute little class oh my god this is gonna be so sassy this is my i don't even know i'm not even leaving the house i can't even make jokes about it <laughs> this is so cute i think it's velvet it feels like a soft touch thing <gasps> that is so cute that is so cute. I see, I see where this is going. It's very brown themed. I'm loving it, the very earthy tones. Oh my God. <gasps> I don't know if she knew that I liked purple. This is, <gasps> what is it? What is it? <gasps> is this a dress? <gasps> oh my God. Oh, this is cute. This is cute. This is cute. This is cute. I'm vibing. Oh, the colors, you know, it, no, no, I think it's a different purple. I was trying to make a book. This is cute. This is cute. I don't know what um, half of these brands are. New York and Company. I am from the UK, so we, we, we don't know. But this, I'm vibing. I also love a good v-neck because, you know, I want to show off a little bit of the, the boobies. Oh my god, this is cute. I think this is more 60s in my opinion, but um, I'm not very um, educated in the matter because I'm just new to this whole... 60s 70s game but this oh yes and i'm guessing this this is supposed to go with it this would look really cute as like a um oh like a headscarf maybe i don't know witchy witchy vibes maybe like a, a little neckerchief you know moment <gasps> oh i can see i can see the vision i can see the vision <gasps> is this crochet I love crochet. Oh, oh, oh my god! Major vibes, major vibes. Oh, yes. You know what? I was also looking for like a crochet waistcoat moment. This is so on it. Yes. Oh my god. You know what? I'm really sad that um, the festival season has like been and gone because this is the kind of stuff that I would have wanted to wear. Oh, this is so cool. This is so cool. Um, I think it's connected to... No? Okay. We've got like a little tassel thing, so I'm guessing I could tie it up. And I could almost make it like a top with like a cute bra underneath, you know? I love. And I think... Is this a belt? <gasps> Ooh! I don't want to break it! <gasps> is this a hip belt? I don't own one of these. This is cute. This is cute. I feel like I can see the vision coming together, but I also want to kind of like wait till I read the letter. 
This is cute. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, you know what? Right. <laughs> for like the past two weeks, right, I've just bought a suit for myself for the Christmas party. And I've been wanting like a white blousey kind of shirt thing to wear underneath. And I thought, you know what, I'm gonna hold off because maybe Steph might have put one in. And she has. Girl. Girl. Yes. This is what I wanted. <laughs> and I love the contrast stitching. Major vibes. <gasps> you know what, and as well, like, this, this is the thing. I'm so pinicky about shirts because I don't want it to be one of those ones that like crease because I, I won't iron my clothes like I'm too lazy to iron I don't even own an iron so this looks like it's not gonna crease so yes we love oh my god can't wait to try this all on oh and there's another belt oh yes I think it's suede as well I love I love suede and I love velvet this is cute I love the um the square buckle detailing that's very cute Oh my god, I'm excited. Shall I open the accessories now? Should I? Yeah, we'll open the accessories now. I love this little bag though. And it's got cute little, um, I don't know if you can see. Please excuse my bed nail varnish. <laughs> but look at that! We're both, we're both hella into our deep astrology. And um, I just thought that was a cute little touch. <gasps> oh, oh, there's another letter in here. Oh, oh! <gasps> No way, girl. No way. Oh my god. I don't know if you can see right now, but like, she's put like, are they like dried rose petals? The dried flower petals? I love that because honestly, not that I've told anyone, but I have a rose bush in my garden and I've been collecting all of the rose petals when the, the wind blows them off the, the bush and I've been drying them out and keeping them in the little jar because, um, I don't know, I just, I just like to keep things. I'm a bit... <sighs> I'm so excited and also I don't know if she knew this but I was also trying to find a new pair of these because I had a pair of these a long time ago but then they got really bent and misshapen um but these ones are purple and these are gonna go with my makeup look if I can get them on my wig <laughs> wow oh you know what they also they are also purple. I can see out purple. Everything's purple. This is cool. This is cool. And it goes through my lipstick. Girl, you did not know. <laughs> what? <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. Right, so I was having this discussion with my partner before. I saw this thing on TikTok and it was someone had put a hole through like their um silicone plugs so they could wear normal earrings and i'm definitely gonna do it because how freaking cool are these oh my god oh my god they they look like the it's been like etched into there that is so cool you know i've been on the hunt for some like sort of like 60s style earrings for ages but i didn't know how i was gonna wear them but now that tiktok video has saved my life <gasps> oh Oh, there's like dried flowers in here. I wish you could see. I probably should have angled my camera better. Ah, oh, but there's just like lots and lots of, of flowers. This is so cute. Oh my God. I, I, I was saying to myself, if I cry in this video, it's gonna be very embarrassing, but I'm just so excited. I think there's like stones in here. Wait, I think there is. <gasps> Girl. My chaotic ass is just filled in SD cards, so... <laughs> we're back, we're back. I don't know if I showed you guys, but she put some crystals in here. I'm not sure which one this is, because I have a crystal book. And I will look it up, but um, I'm not well acquainted with the crystals yet. I think this one's Amethyst. Um, slap me if I'm wrong. And also, I feel like this one might be, but I could be completely wrong. That's so exciting because, and I know she has no idea of this, but I feel like she's just like reading my mind from the side of the world because I have been wanting to get some crystals for the longest time and I didn't really know which ones to get because there's no like stores around me. I kind of live in the middle of nowhere, so I think I'd have to go to a city. But I feel like Steph's chose these ones for a reason and I will look up 
what these stones mean, but that's so exciting because these will be my first crystals. Thank you. That is so cute. Um, so I'm just gonna put them on my shelf because I don't want to lose them, but they are so cute. Now, I think there's like another little note in this bag. Oh wait! Oh! Sorry, I'm so sorry headphone users. These are so cute! I also don't know if she knows this, I am obsessed with the flower of life. I feel like it keeps cropping up. It has been cropping up in my life for maybe the past six years and I honestly want to get it tattooed on me somewhere, like I'm kind of thinking of maybe getting it on my hand, but also don't want to ruin future job prospects, but also kind of don't care. <laughs> um, but also snakes have been coming up a lot in my life, maybe the past three weeks. There was like a week where there was reference to snakes pretty much every day for a whole week and it was freaking me out because I am terrified of snakes. But this, I don't know, it, feel, it gives me peace, so... It's a sign and also, I don't know if she knows, I am obsessed with butterflies and moths. I have four moth tattoos at this point. I'm just obsessed and I don't know why, it just, it brings me joy. So I don't know if she knew but these cards have really, this is really what I'm going through right now and that is so cute. Um, but I really want to read the letter that she's put with them. <gasps> oh! Oh my god, is this a lunar moth? Is this a lunar moth? Because I also have a lunar moth tattooed. Um, I don't know if anyone ever notices it. I think a lot of people are like, oh, cool butterfly, and I'm like, it's a lunar moth, it's a lunar moth. But that's really cute. And I'm sure she mentioned her love for lunar moths in her altar video as well. But yeah, I'm going off on a ramble here, but she's put a little message on the back and it says, Aries are strong and courageous. They have a brave heart ruled by Mars. Nothing is impossible. And honestly, I think that is very true. I've been through so much crap in my life and I think I've come out of the end strong and courageous and I do kind of wear my heart on a sleeve a lot of the time and sometimes it can bite me in the ass and <laughs> I'm going off on a ramble here but yeah, nothing is impossible. You know, you are in control of your own destiny sometimes and the way that you sort of react to sort of the hardships that you've gone through is what helps make you stronger in my opinion but anyways let's not get all teary-eyed because i'm feeling quite emotional it's it's a pisces full moon right now and <sighs> i'm feeling the emotions anyways let's read them out <gasps> oh, oh i don't know which one to read first right okay um I'm gonna go with this one first. Hey Dakota, before I start explaining your bundle, I want to say you are so awesome. <laughs> Don't make me cry. <laughs> if you ever think of coming coming to the US, we should hang. Totally. I I really wanna to come to the US and I think um I think you're based in Chicago. I feel like we'd vibe and I just really wanna go thrift shopping with you and just I don't know, just have a good time, but that's expensive, so it's gonna be a while. <laughs> but I will get there eventually, I promise. You're beyond funny and I think that says kind. Cool, cool. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm dyslexic. <laughs> also, thank you for your kind words. You are such a genuine, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> You're such a genuine person. I hope <laughs> I'm actually gonna cry. <laughs> Stop! It's a Pisces moon. I hope you like all I'm sending you, please tag me on your outfits and if you make a video, I would post it on my channel. Um, your bundle, I went all out, I couldn't find shoes. That's okay, I know it would have been so expensive to ship from um, the US to the UK and I have plenty of shoes, so don't worry about it, girl. Um, not the kind that I wanted to get you at least. It's okay, I'm so finicky about shoes. And also, if anyone's seen <laughs> my new rock boots unboxing, Sizing is chaotic for me, so I don't blame you. It's okay, girl. First outfit, Psychedelic Queen. I feel like I should pick the items up so we can kind of go through it together. I found the cutest Paisley flares. Yes, Queen, you did. I am living for these. I'm so excited to wear these. Nothing more 60s looking. I paired that with a white blouse and a white knitted vest. Cut, cause you were showing me so many. Yeah, I, I think that was kind of like a recurring theme in 
my Pinterest board, and a brown vest. Oh, so the brown vest as well. Okay, cool. I can see, I can see the colour combination. Yes, queen. I also really, I'm really um, obsessed with texture, so I love how we've got the different textures going. I feel like this is gonna feel really good on. The vest style is very Jim Morrison, Hendrix-esque. I also found such a cute embroidered purse. Super inspired by free people. Yes, I love free people. Can't afford free people. But their styling is everything. So this is the purse to go with. Oh, and wear the golden belt. Okay, I see, I see. Oh, you know, this is very warm toned. I am used to like all black outfits. So this is, this is out of my comfort zone, but I see the vision. Can we see the vision? I'm sorry, I'm not, I'm not showing this very well. The second outfit, casual penny lane for this outfit. I, oh, by the way, just before we get into this, I hadn't watched, um, Almost Famous until I watched one of Steph's videos. She did like a styling video for it. You should go and check it out. It was really cool. And I was like, oh my God, I didn't even think to watch this film. But now you mentioned it. As soon as she mentioned it, I went, went and watched it. And um, yeah, this styling is immaculate. So thank you for introducing me to that. For this outfit, I found such a, a cute purple dress with a very 1960s pattern. Also found this black belt, which is also very 60s, which reminds me of the ones the monkeys and the birds wore and the and wear the purple scarf around your neck or hair. Yeah, so that's kind of what I was thinking too. But we love we love the, the colour combination here. I love the whole um what is it called? Colour blocking? Yeah, I'm vibing. This is gonna look so cute on. So there's another letter. And she's drawn a little sun on it, which I think is really cute. I've included some jewelry and knickknacks in the little purple pouch, but it's a surprise. Open and see. I don't know how long till it'll take for you to receive this but i can't wait love you so much stay groovy steph i love you girl thanks <sighs> wow i just need to take a second to breathe because i i just want to cry i'm feeling i'm feeling that pisces moon and i feel quite emotional i feel like i inadvertently i guess i was just feeling the vibes of the box and just went for like this 60s look so i'm gonna do a try on now to see what it all looks like together and um yeah <laughs> thank you to Steph because oh my god girl you have killed it and this is I I, I didn't really didn't know what to anticipate but this is I'm just so happy with everything that you put in this bundle and the cute little stones and the cards and just everything and it was the cutest and your little notes and almost made me teary eyed <sighs> I'm so glad that my first bundle experience was with you and it's been a really positive one I feel like you kind of anticipated and knew what I wanted without me even knowing what I wanted, if that makes sense. I, like I said, I'm totally new on this 70s, 60s um, style venture, so it's been really good for someone who is really into that to kind of like guide me. And um, yeah, thank you so much. Um, I really want to order another one from you at some point, but. America is very expensive to ship from and I'm kind of poor right now so hopefully in the not too distant future we can collaborate again and yeah oh thank you so much if you have not seen Steph's channel please go check her out she's incredible and she does a lot of style content she's really helped me in finding my feet within the, the 60s 70s style community and yeah god thank you girl thank you so much if you like this video please give it a thumbs up comment down below let me know what you think and uh, subscribe if you're not already. Please subscribe to Steph also because her content is super cool and she's so sweet. And oh my God, I'm just still so like, ah! 
yeah <laughs> if you want to see how i did this makeup look it will be on my channel very soon until next time bye guys